Oh, no. Sister Dearest does not get to snap her fingers and have me committed. Mrs. Monson, you're only here to be evaluated. Look, don't waste your breath, okay? Because no one is going to evaluate me until I speak with her privately first. That wouldn't be advisable. Well, then I guess you've got a bit of a problem, haven't you? By the way, do I get to call my lawyer? Or do I not even have the rights of a common prisoner? Look, Carly, if I do what you ask, will you let the doctors do what they need to do? Oh, sure. I'll let them watch me put square pegs into square holes and tell them that that nasty little ink blot reminds me of a rose garden. I, I think it will be all right. All right, but the door stays open. And I'm going to be right outside. Swell. So this is what it's come to, huh? Getting me into a maternity straitjacket. That really makes your day. Carly, I'm not enjoying any of this. Liar. It's the truth. You still blame me because you lost Mike. You think that I ruined your life and you hate me, but this hurts you more than it hurts me. You bring Please. out the worst in me, Carly. What can I say? Every time I get involved with you, I end up feeling bad about myself. It's hard to enjoy that. Well, then how about a little trade-off, huh? I'll feel badly about myself, and you can be locked in the booby hatch. Carly, you had me up against a wall with your hands around my neck. Now, I, I could have just called the guards and had them throw you out, but I didn't. I called the hospital because I, I wanted to be sure you wouldn't hurt yourself or hurt the baby. Santa, I came here looking for a little help from my sister. We have an argument, and... I wind up in a loony bin. It's not nice, is it? No, it isn't. Hey, fix it. Help me out here. All right. I will. I'll call your husband and I'll tell him to come here. Don't you dare do that. Why not, Carly? I'm not going to tell him about the trust. I'll just tell him to come rescue his wife. You don't get it. How can't see me like this? He can't know anything about this trip. If there's even a chance of, of patching things up, this will wreck it. The truth will wreck it. I need him. Without him, this baby and I have nothing, thanks to you. I, I hope this child never learns why it was conceived. This baby means everything to me, and it, it's not about the money. <sighs> Forgive me, Carly. But the way I see it, you've been pregnant twice. Once to get my man, and this time to get my money. The love of a child doesn't seem to enter into it much. Oh, no, that's... That's a terrible thing to say, Rosanna. Especially given that I lost my little girl. I lost my little Nora. Because of you. Now, if you're not going to help this child, just please don't go out of your way to harm it by getting me locked in a padded cell or tattling to Hal. The way you twist things is incredible. Listen to me. I love this little life that's growing inside me. And in a way that you couldn't possibly understand unless you felt it for yourself. This is all I have. Don't take it away from me. Look, Carly. Your life is not working. It's falling apart. You need someone to help you. Now, if you don't want it to be me and not your husband, then... Is there someone else? Yes. There is. There's one other person.